Hi, this is Chad Clark, uh, Physical Therapy Connections here in Pueblo, Colorado. And I wanted to start off by saying this month is my workshop on the knee workshop for ACL and basically any knee condition um, that may be bothering you, how to prevent them, how to uh, do better with knee problems. So you might be wondering why I'm in a squat position. Uh, last month in Michael Flores' shoulder workshop, he was hanging and said you should be able to hang for up to two minutes. So I wanted to show something that a person should be able to do is stay in a deep squat position um, for at least one minute, if not um, longer. So you could work up, and believe it or not, you should be able to do 10 minutes at a time. So that's a lot for many people. So if you start off just seeing if you could do a partial squat, this is an extreme position. So I'm not saying everyone should do this right away, especially if you are having knee problems or knee pain uh, that we will definitely discuss in our workshop. But I did want to show that person should be able to do this and I figured out oh, what, what better way to do this and give a little video uh, talk about the workshop that's coming up and then just show what what it should look like and, and maybe even how it should feel uh, technically uh, you should be able to do it pain-free should have a full range of motion through ankles knees and hips especially through the knees um, and not have any pain so another thing that you could do while after you or during being in the squat position is every 30 seconds rise up and then reposition in the squat. I do have a fairly wide stance and I'm kind of pushing my knees out so it uh, shows that uh, there's good hip mobility there uh, just in case there is some compensations you need because of knee strength or knee limitations. We, there is another one and maybe I'll do this in another video where you should be able to do a full squat with a narrow stance. In fact, maybe I'll just kind of show that that from a narrow stance, you should be able to go into a full squat and get the hips well below the knees um, and, and maintain that with some f uh, in, in a comfortable position. So something that you can try, staying in a squatted position, whether it's narrow or from a wide stance going all the way down. Um, if there's any pain or you just do not feel safe, please don't try this. You could do a modified where maybe you just go in a partial stance. You'll definitely feel the burn in the thighs um, after some people even 20, 30 seconds, you'll feel that. So I wanted to show that and also mention that we do have the workshop, which is this month, June 18th, Tuesday at 5 p.m. to 6 p.m. All your questions can be answered. I'll give a topic of or the topic is knee and ACL in particular, but we'll talk about prevention, getting out of pain, and how to perform better with any activity or sport. So hopefully that was helpful and uh, give it a try. Just make sure you do that safe and pain-free. But if you're able to do that um, for more than one minute, we'd love to see some videos of people doing that or pictures and uh, please post them. Uh, once again, the workshop's coming up Tuesday, June 18th, 5 p.m. to 6 p.m.